Hello to everyone. How are you? This is Joanna and here I'm going to share with you what I got from Bath and Body Works and just a few things that I found at Meyer. I actually went out to Meyer to be nosy, of course, first to see the dark Starbucks cups and they had all of them. I just wasn't into them, which is a good thing. Now, I'm starting to regret back in March when I saw that pink one and did that post about walking away. I kind of wish now I would have got one of those, um, but I didn't. And I'm going to let that go. But I really didn't like the ones they had today. I thought that I wanted the pink and green recycled glass one. I even shared that with somebody on Instagram. We were talking back and forth. Um, I said I wanted it. And then I changed my mind. I don't want any of the cups. And that's great. However, if I were to see that copper siren and I were to see that purple um, oil slick again, all bets are off. I want those cups regardless. So... I do have two of one and one of the other, so that should be enough. But I want to share with you what I got from Meyer really quickly. It's just a few items. Um, I went ahead and got a 12-pack of this, and I put it up. I had the 12-pack, and it, I've never seen the cans be green, but I used to love the Cherry Dr. Pepper. I hope that I love this. I actually had the nerve to be in there looking for the berry one. Um, and they probably sold out of that within days of it being in there because it was nowhere to be found now that I like it. So if I do see it out at Schnucks or something, I will go ahead and pick up a 12 pack in the regular, not the diet. They had the broccoli package like this. I love that when it's little like this. So I did get two of those. And then this right here is the little banquet chicken that I was talking about. I used to buy this years ago when I lived downtown. And I had to have been 19 or 20 then. So when I saw this that week that I mentioned this in Meyer, I was very happy to see it. They used to make one that was called hot and spicy. And of course, it wasn't really hot, but it was flavorful. So I'm hoping this will be as good as I remember. This is a nice, quick way to make chicken for your family. I know that when I did it before, I was able to make it in the oven. So I haven't read to see if the directions have changed or if they have included microwave use. I will more than likely put it in the oven because you can take the frozen pieces out. I really did like this then, and I hope it is just as good today. So I'm going to put these items up, and then I'm going to also share with you the snacks that I got. So as far as the snacks, I did pick up some Blasto Butter Popcorn. They had some, and I did not know they had this. And I got the On the Border Monterey Jack Queso, and I don't know... If this is the one that I had, I don't think it's the one that I had when we did the um, going away theme for my coworker friend. I don't remember if I had this or not, but I didn't get any chips. I was looking for the Cantina Thin, so I'll probably have to wait till I go to Schnucks. And then, of course, today, guys, I got a Snickers popcorn. It is open in the refrigerator. And then I got this one. I have a nurse friend that used to live here that loved Butterfingers, so... I'm planning on sending her a fur baby package for her puppies, but I also want to send some things for her. So I plan on getting her a bag of this Butterfinger popcorn um, and some of the Butterfinger cooking chips and mini Butterfingers and what have you because that was her candy, her weakness, her thing. And then, of course, they had Pringles. I've already been in them. They had the reduced fat. I got them, and these are mighty fresh and tasty. So now we're going to get all that out of the way. I'm going to share with you what I got from Bath & Body Works. Pieces for my daughter and just a few for me. And then what I picked up at Victoria's Secret and Sephora is very little, but I did want to share it with you. And I would like to add, I plugged up my wallflower plug in the lemon pound cake. And whether it's on sale or not, guys, I think I want a few more of those. It is smelling really scrumptious. I plugged it up yesterday, and I think that's why when I did that accidental pause in my video where I actually forgot to pause the foam... If you heard me take a big inhale and exhale, I was inhaling that. It smells really, really good. So what I got from Bath & Body Works, so should I start with this little thing? They gave me one of these coupons yesterday, right? And I thought that I could use it. Well, it doesn't start till July the 6th. So I'm wondering if that's when the Victoria's Secret sale is over. I think our Bath & Body Works one is until the 11th. 
of July. And do y'all know I was in the store and here at home and I'm trying to figure out if I had the copper coconut lotion. I sent a message to somebody, but they didn't get back to me, at least not while I was out. So I went ahead and ordered that today. I did go ahead and order the summertime syrup after declaring I didn't need it. And then I also need to know I have been trying to find out if I have the fairy tale full size body mist. I know that I bought a bunch of body mist for Christmas. I don't know if I kept one for myself or not. So online, I ordered the love one so that I can exchange it because it's not on sale and the fairy tale in my store is not on sale, nor is it on sale in online. So that will be an even exchange. I went ahead and got that body mist. I think it was $16.50 and I'll exchange it for fairy tale. But I got this for myself because I really do favor the warm vanilla sugar. All the flack that I gave them over this scent, this scent came out when my son was about two, so probably about 2001 or so, but he tore down the whole display and they were so sweet. He tore down the display because it was his height and he kept knocking into it. And I had such a fit about this scent because as you know, it replaced my loved vanilla bean. And I think I stayed out of the store for a couple of years, guys. And then right when I went back in the store, they had fresh vanilla, which I was so mad at myself because I ended up with one cream, a spray, and a shower gel. That was the best vanilla scent that they have made. I swear to God, I wish they would make it again. But I really do favor the way that this is in the hand gel form on the hands. This right here is what my daughter wanted. She wanted the rose water and ivy and mahogany one now i hear a lot of people on here talking about the strawberry pound cake blended one and the cafe blended one those two would be my choice if i were to get one of these blended candles and like i said my daughter usually likes the things that i'm not too crazy about they seem to work for her so this was the one that she wanted if i'm able to go back i'll get her too i think these were 10.95 today but i'm not sure she wanted the um, pear creme brulee. I asked her if she wanted the mist, the cream, or both. She prefers the mist. Whereas I prefer the lotion in most things, she prefers the mist. So this is for her. And then I wanted to go ahead, since I have the mist and since I have the lotion, and get another cotton candy clouds. And I do have a second lotion in what I placed an order for. And this one is because I really like this, even though I have not used it yet, the rainbow cereal. I do want to take this one into work and see how it goes over. So the last two things that I got was this right here. Um, talking to Mrs. Shaughnessy and I did send her a message that I went into the store. Lo and behold, they had a bunch of them. I wasn't expecting to find it, but I was hoping to find it because I seem to have a big problem <laughs> when things come in a set. I try to get one or a few. Used to be, guys, I didn't do that. You heard me say that I would show up at Bath & Body Works. If they had a group of six things out, I would pick one or two that I liked the most. I would get the gel and the lotion. That would be it, hands down. Every blue moon, if it was wintertime, I might get the cream and make it a third piece, but I always got the gel and the lotion. And here lately, I can't seem to get anything just a piece if it comes in a set of three or four. So I did go ahead and get this, which completes my set for this. And this was what Miss Shaughnessy talked about. And I did really love the tester cream. So this being the first, this one right here, this is my second item. I decided to go into Kohl's, which they didn't have any. And I had my bag over my shoulder and that little girl made me feel like she thought I was shoplifting. Like I was over where the Sol de Janeiro stuff was. And I was spraying what they had. They did not have any of these new ones at all. I rounded the corner and went to the wall. And I turned around and this little girl whipped out of nowhere. And I'm like, I know that they have to watch things, but I was not doing anything suspicious. Um, I had things in that bag. I carry a bag on my shoulder. It had my Bath and Body Works bag. So I wasn't doing anything suspicious. And plus, guys, I ain't going to jail for nobody. I think they need to realize that people of a certain age, you know what I mean? I mean, I understand that there are all kinds of people that say that. I understand that people do a lot, but Joanna here ain't getting ready to go to jail for nobody. I can't help my family if I'm in jail. So 
they didn't have it so i did go to our mall one because i had to wait to transfer the buses they had two they had this one and the blue one and they had the other one up there too the one that sold out the purple one and guys i can see why it sold out it smelled nice i really did like all three of these because i have said before i either love it all or i hate it all i love all three of these i'm glad they are in the 20 dollars size so my goal is to get the other two um on sephora i'm going to be placing an order is where the blue one will come from but that purple one is sold out on there it's sold out in the stores and i don't know if kohl's just hasn't got it yet but i will have to keep up with them for that one and i think guys that's all that i got i didn't get anything else they gave me this little sample thing here i haven't even paid enough attention to look at this to see if it's perfume or cologne so luna rosa ocean it's in a bottle that looks like it might be cologne but that is it so until the next time i want everyone to have a great day i'm gearing up to go to work tomorrow i cannot believe it is thursday already i did not make it out to the cookie place i wanted to go back for another cookie butter and a honey bun because my son really favored honey buns um when he was in first second and third grade like when we would go to the grocery store you know how your kids have to have that one thing most kids back then was into fruit roll-ups and mine wanted honey buns no fluff no frill he wanted the plain glazed honey buns so that is it everyone have a great day and i'm looking at all of y'all's hauls making my list so again until the next time everyone have a great day